Let us not forget Renee, loving mother, sister, and friend. Well, we, uh, we have to figure out what to do with Dawn. She's going to need some place to live. I want to take her. Could we talk about this in private? Her mother was just murdered. How can we possibly think about ourselves? As soon as I graduate, I'm going to get a job so I can move out, and I won't be a burden for long. Dawn, you're not a burden. <laughs> We've got to show Dawn what it's like to have a good home. Can you help me do that? Why did you give a toast instead of saying a prayer? Have I committed some terrible pastor faux pas? Go! We're okay, right? Get out! We're good. Dawn, will you talk to me? Please don't go, Dawn, please! You are a liar! And you are not a godly man. You have to let this Dawn thing go. You didn't make her leave. I have to find her. I have to find Dawn. Why didn't you post these flyers? Because Dawn's not missing. She chose to leave. You know what I hate about living in the city? Can't see any of the stars at night. After everything I've done for you, you can't help me. Why do you make me like this? Mom, um, it's like I said, Don. You need someone, someone there to look after you. You can't save Don. Only Don can save Don. Just look at how beautiful you are. I spent my entire life serving God, and I got nothing. But do you know him? You matter, Don. To no one else, you matter to me. Stop. Please, you're hurting me! Where'd they go? Did you just get out? Why don't you sit down? You're not the first girl to be here, okay? He doesn't love you. Or me. Where is she? God, I want to trust you again. <sighs> Oh